Hey guys, today I'll show you how to get a perfect salon blowout right at home. Comb through your fresh clean hair to make sure it's tangle free. It will make the process of blow drying a lot less painful. Now it's time to part your hair the way you like to wear it. I recommend using a heat protectant anytime heat touches your hair and that includes blow drying. If you have split ends like I do, this split end fixer is like a miracle for my hair. When you're doing the blowout at home, you always want to start from the front because we all have those baby hairs, so you want to make sure to address those first to really smooth them out. The way that you know that a section is dry is that the hair gets really shiny and a lot of shape starts to form. Next, section off the crown of your head, and that's the top section in case you didn't know, and then pin it to get it out of your way. The easiest way to get to the back part is to split it into two sections and bring them to the front. Now that the back section of my hair is dry, I'm going to start on the top part. The easiest way to work on the section is to over direct it and pull it forward. I just love how much volume it gives me and I haven't even teased my hair yet. And there you have it, a perfect salon blowout that you can do at home.